Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Chrono Trigger. So I think we're gonna do Frog's quest. Real quick though, we're going to need Frog in our party. So let's go ahead and grab him. And let me make sure. Let's go ahead and put the ruby armor on him. The Guardia Helm on him. Okay, now we need to go to the Northern Ruins. Okay, so we're looking for an island with some red buildings on it. I don't know where it's at, but I guess I will just keep flying until I run into it? Question mark? I think this is it. I think this has to be it. Yeah, I think this is some continent that we've never been able to reach before. West Cape. Here lies a great explorer, Toma Levine. Okay. Guess let's keep exploring. Residence. All my husband does is sit at that tavern all day, nursing drinks. Well, just wait till he comes home. He'll be nursing a sword jaw then. I'll be a carpenter, like my dad. Okay. Ooh, why can't I go through that building? That's weird. Chorus in. Okay, so Tenji for a night. Bring me another mug. Sir, I think you've had quite enough already. Who are you to tell me when I've had enough? You're worse than my wife. What's wrong with the carpenter having a few pints in the afternoon, huh? Have you heard about the ghost, I mean? Yes. Oh, I wanted to be first to tell you. No, I guess not. They say a ghost? Ghostly night haunts the northern ruins. Scary, huh? Okay. Okay, well, we need to go to May... Okay, so we're gonna have to go to the ruins, but first, let's talk to the mayor. There's an old structure to the north. Okay, so he's not gonna tell me much of anything useful here. Tomorrow should be a beautiful day as well. So everyone can see the Black Omen, which is funny. It's kind of popped up out of nowhere. Wait, can I steal this cake? No, I can't. Okay. Let's go ahead and go to the ruins here. Grr. Oh, you gotta fight him? Oh, do I need to run? My sword is to no avail. Cyrus? Tis I, Glenn. Huh? Glenn? Grr. Okay, so he recognizes Frog. Is that Cyrus? And it looks like we can't go to that door because it's been abandoned. Okay. Okay, so let's go back to 600. We need to go to 600, the Middle Ages here. And let's see what... Okay, so let's see what happens to the town here. Market? Okay, can we buy anything different? Not really. Okay, so nothing different at the market. Okay, so that dude says the same thing in... Guys says the same thing at all the time periods. Tavern, see what we can do here. Is there anything we can do in this room? Nope, it's still blocked. Okay. There's some... Why is Chrono confused? Did I put something bad on him on accident? I'll have to check. Let's take the sunglasses off of Ayla. And these guys, they all drop high ethers when I kill them. So it actually would be kind of smart to farm these guys. But obviously, um, hmm, I don't know if I will. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and rest at the inn here. Just because all of Magus's MP got stolen and I will need that MP. Ooh, there's a chest back there. Okay, but let's go to the tavern. Robbed of my carpentry tools. How am I to work without my tools? Ah, uh, this is Toma. Ah, well, Mike Chrono, I finally stumbled upon a hint as to the whereabouts of the rainbow shell. Still, I can't shake the feeling that things will go sour this time. I fear my luck may have finally run out. Say, would you mind holding on to this for me? Toma's spirits. 
Should the worst befall me, I would mean a lot to me if you'd pour that over my headstone. A touch more, but I know, but I beg you. Okay, so now when we go back, well, we should do that. Okay, let's go ahead and go back to 1,000 here. Yeah, let's go back to 1,000. Let's go to the grave. So we can go ahead and pour that stuff on it, and then we'll go talk to the guy in the tavern again. Okay, so here... Here lies the great explorer Tom Levine. Let's go ahead and pour that on here. Chrono, it's been many a day. I located the rainbow cell, as it were. To the northwest of this cape is a large island called the Giant's Claw. The shell is there. Okay. But beware, there are droves of monsters afoot there. Well then, I believe this is farewell. Truly is no drink so fine as the one shared in the company of friends like you. All the best to you. Okay, so that'll start off for Marl's side quest, but we're gonna do that one next episode. Let's go ahead and go back to the tavern, or the inn. You want to borrow my tools? Well, sure, why not? Be my guest. I'm a little busy, as you can see, though. You'll need to go grab them from my wife. Okay. All my husband does is sit at the tavern and nursing drinks. What? His tools? Oh, hold on. They're right here. carpenter tools okay so I'm pretty sure now I can use those to fix the castle okay guys so back to 600 AD we go and we can now give the carpenter his tools are those are those carpentry tools you're holding might you be willing to lend them to me for a while yes my thanks right now I can finally get to work again perfect maybe I need to go to his house again um, I just gotta remember. Okay, this is the market. Which one's his house again? I think it's this one. Okay, yep, wait. You, you've my thanks for lending me these tools. It was most gracious of you. Now I can finally get back to work. Alright. What well, say we start with the ruins up north? On your feet, you lazy do not, whatever you say, master. Okay, so now they're going back to work, and I think now. We can actually go to the ruins here. We've done all we can. We can't repair monster-infested places. Let us know when you've cleared a floor of beasties. We'll handle the rest. On your feet, you lazy do not. Whatever you say, master. Okay, so we have to kill everything on each floor, if I'm correct. Okay, I guess let's go this way. I'll start everything on this floor. Okay. Okay, I guess let's go back and tell him that we've cleared the monsters and hopefully hopefully he'll be able to let's see. You want the northern, uh, yes, so we cleared the monsters. We'll have to pay 2,000 G, but that's really not too much of anything. Okay. So now, is it going to be fixed? We, can. we can't repair monster infested places. Okay, so it looks like I'm gonna have to clear one floor at a time then. Oh, I think now I have to go down the other stairwell. So there should be stuff here now. Okay, so they fixed that. Okay, perfect. So now I can keep going. Here rests Cyrus, the fool who defied Magus. Cyrus, I have returned. I will fulfill the oath I swore so long ago, and my, fa my final promise to you as well. Cyrus, Glenn, thank you for making the journey all this way. 
You must think ill of me. You think o you think over much. You've come far, my friend. I was never as fine a warrior as you are now. As Magus's fire consumed me, my heart burned with the thoughts of all I'd left unfinished and I left behind. Magus, King Guardia, Queen Lene, and of course you, my dear good friend. But the skills you've honed over this time are superior to any I could have I could ever claim to know. I can rest now knowing that all will be made right by your hands. Farewell, my friend. Wait, I The Queen, look after Queen Lene. Farewell, Glenn, my friend. Forgive me, Cyrus. Hmm? The Masamian? What else? All that emotional baggage was weighing you down. The hero's strength is strength of will. Can't very well save the world if you're dwelling on the past. Now you're truly strong. True strength. And now we can use all of our power too, can't we, Masa? with strength. Ah, the Masa means true form. I must go now, Cyrus, but I go follow in your footsteps and see done all that you had wished. May my actions honor you. Come, let us be on our way. Okay. So we got 200. That's even more than Chrono, right? Chrono only has 168. Although Chrono's sword is very, very weak at the moment, so I will definitely have to get a new one. Okay, guys, so now all we have to do is go and repair it once again, and we'll have access to the other portion, but um, we'll want to do something in particular. So let's go ahead and pay him again. So what we we'll want to do is there's going to be some sealed chests in there. What we're going to want to do is not open them. So then we could get a better item when we come back here in the present. So if we go over here. Okay, so they've repaired all that they can, which is cool. Now if we go over here, this should be repaired. Yep, so we can go in here. Let's see, we don't want to open that yet. We basically don't want to open any chests. Oop, well, we will have to fight some monsters really quickly. Where are we going here? Oop, I'll have to fight just a couple more. Easy enough. Okay, one more fight. One more fight. I think this should be the last one here. Okay. Okay, so what we're going to want to do is not open them here. Is reacting to the penguin. Remove the item. No. Is, uh, remove the item. No. And we should be able to get some items that are a lot better than that. Hopefully, if I'm, I think if I'm doing this right. And let's just open this chest. Obtained elixir, so that one's not anything special. Okay, so now these should be powered up. Obtain Moonbeam Armor. Yep, so like I thought. Okay, so yes, they are now leveled up. So they are going to be a lot better. I don't think we'll have to do any fighting since we cleared them last time. Okay. We got the Suzaku. Okay, which is a sword for Chrono, I'm pretty sure. And a Valkyrie Bow. And I think that is... Marl's one of Marl's strongest weapon if not the strongest maybe um, not 100% sure but I think so okay. and there should be one more power tab 
here. Perfect. Strength capsule. Okay, cool. So, this is actually almost Frog's side quest done here. So, we got all of our upgraded weapons. And what's nice is now we can actually go back. So, now we're once again back at 600 AD. And if we go back, we can actually get all of that stuff once again and get all of the old equipment. So, we got the elixir. I think here we're going to get the unupgraded equipment. Yes, remove the item. So now we got a Nova armor and it's upgraded form. So, which is super, super, super cool here. So back in lab. Okay, cool. Um, let me make sure the capsules are completed. Okay, guys. So there's only one really last thing we need to do with Frog. And that is get his gold rock, which will equip the three, you know, his try attack. But to do that... Um, okay, I don't want to go to the Black Omen. We need to go to Dorado Mountains here. Yes, okay, so now we need to... Ooh, I just dodged that like a pro. We need to go to the top here, and we need to go to the portion where that one thing is throwing rocks. Strong rocks. Oh, see, he caught a rock. You're no match for me, freelancer. The rock glows in Frog's hand. Obtain golden gemstone. Frog, I am no longer the frog I was before. And I think that's it. Okay. As far as Frog goes, that is, I think, the last thing we needed from him. So, I guess now we just have to okay. get out of here. Cool. So, now we are completely done with Frog's side quest. Let's see who we're going to do next. We did Magus. Okay. I guess we could do Fiona's side quest. Let's do that one. And I know we can because when Zeal was still alive, we did talk to the girl with the sapling. Okay, and I think, funny enough, we're already in the right place. The only thing is I'm gonna wanna now uh, change my party up. I want Robo back. Let's go ahead and put the Moonbeam armor on him. Okay, I think he is good. Is there anything else I can... Yes, I forgot. I almost forgot that I got a whole new sword for him. So let's go ahead and put that on him. Um, I could put the Nova armor on him, which is even better. And I'll leave the sunglasses. And for Magus, this is already his best stuff, so we're good on that. Let's go ahead and switch him out for Robo, and let's make Chrono the leader here. Okay, so now we should just be able to go in here and talk to her or her husband. My husband, Marco, is finally home from the war. Oh, I'm so relieved. Worry not, my love. We won't be parted again. The monsters in the desert cave fear water. They seem vulnerable to it. With the greatest of them, water or no, I could not hope to slay that beast on my own. So I'm guessing we have to kill it. Okay. So, I'm guessing this is what they're talking about right here, the sunken desert. And we have to kill whatever's here. Fair enough. Let's get going. Oh, do I get, like, stuck in it? Okay, well, I wanted to pick up that chest, but it looks like we're fighting first. So I'm pretty sure these guys are weak to water and ice. So I'm going to be one of... I'm going to using ice too almost every single fight most likely here and i don't know the level of these guys but they look to be okay so that guy had you know a good 800 hp or even more than that okay we got a lapis here looks like we got a lot of fights coming let's just try to uh physically attack these guys just to see how much it does and of course this is all good because either way we're gaining XP. Okay, a high ether. Easy XP. There's a lot of fights in here. But I'm guessing that's kind of the point of this. Okay, let's 
see what's in this chest here. Just an elixir. And, ooh, just need this chest. And an, okay, we already have one of those, so we're fine. High potion, that's pretty good, actually. A sudden earthquake, perhaps. Ooh. Melfix. So he's the one draining the life from this land. But engaging monsters capable of moving through the earth is against all logical protocols. 5,000 G? Okay. That's a pretty good amount. Turbo Ether? Come on. Anion Helm? Oh, there he is. Can we fight him right now? Okay, I forgot which part of the body is which. Let's see. Okay, so the top is magic. Let's hit his feet. No? Okay, let's hit him with the ice too. Let's see which part of him is weak. Oh, so maybe I gotta hit him. I have to hit him with... I have to hit him with ice and then... Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Okay. Let's go ahead and use... A rapid fire fist on his head. Let's do a frenzy on his head. Now let's do another ice too. I wonder, will this even lower his defense even more or... Okay, so defense looks like his defense is reduced even more. I don't know what I just did there. I think it might just be a normal attack. Okay, how much HP does the top part have? Oh, there we go. Okay, so that just now heals his bottom. Wait, I didn't keep track of Chrono's health. Oh, he's fine. Okay, I probably should... Oh, he might... No, he's not dead. He's not dead. That's fine. He's almost dead, but he's not dead. Let's just use another attack here. Let's hit the bottom. Yeah, we'll just keep pounding the bottom here a little bit. Ooh, I don't have enough MP for that. So I guess we'll just do a normal cleave. There we go. All that's left is the core, so we can just... Running wild without core. <laughs> we have neutralized the source of the decertification. We should inform Madame Fiona. Okay. Now, let's quickly still grab all of the chests. Memory cap. Okay. And we got one more. The muscle ring. Cool. Okay, so let's go out here. We should find something on the left side over here. Right there. Perfect. Yep, a strength capsule. That's exactly what I was looking for. Is that the... Oh, is... Okay, that's how we got out. Okay. Okay, so let's just go back to Fiona's house here. Thank you for dealing with those foul creatures. Now I can set to work replanting again. Alas, I fear it will take ages to plant enough trees to reforest this land. Ah, if only there was someone who could toil for centuries on end. Then these wastes could truly be made green again. What do you think? I could remain here and assist Madame Fiona, and you could come to retrieve me here once my work was complete. Is that alright? May I stay by and help? Let's do that. Okay, so we can see Robo Toiling. That's kind of cool. Okay, guys, so let's go ahead and put Luca in our party because we will need her. Let's go back here, and we must go to 1000 AD. And hopefully, forest will be replanted. Perfect. Oh, where is the town? I don't know if there used to be a town there. Maybe there wasn't. Fiona's Shrine. This is Fiona's shrine. Here we give thanks to Fiona and Robo for reviving the forest scorched in the war against Magus 400 years ago. 
My hats are woven from twigs rich with mystical energies of the forest. Oh, we can buy stuff from her. Okay. That's a good hat, but I don't have enough money for it. Systems reactivated. Where am I? Oh, Chrono, how nice to finally see you again. Only a few moments may have passed for you, but I have been waiting for 400 years. However, my efforts were worthwhile. The forest is restored. Now, shall we celebrate our 400 year reunion? I realized something during these past 400 years. I believe we may have been incorrect in our assumption that Lavos was responsible for the creation of the gates. What do you mean? It is not a certainty, but I have come to believe it is possible that some entity wished for us to witness these events. Perhaps it wanted us to see all of these various ages. Alternatively, it may have wished for them for itself. It seems almost as though it was reflecting on the days of its past. Ayla, no. Person die. See life pass by. Elders say. Before death claims a man, he is made to bear witness a second time to those memories engraved most deeply upon his heart. There may, they may be fond memories among them, yes, but often as not, the ones who grieve us are the most profound. Knowing the end is approaching likely reactivates dormant feelings of regret and desire to return to moments in the past. Do you suppose that will happen when our time comes? Probably. Who knows? Is there a point in time you'd want to return to, Luca? No, not really. I'm sorry, I probably shouldn't have asked. No, it's okay, it's just something I don't like to think about too much. But even if Lavos did not open the gates, his fate is clearly bound to that of the one who did. Lavos has played a role in every age we've seen. Who do you think it is? It is unknown to me whose memories these are. It is likely an entity greater than any of us. Perhaps we will not know until our journey has come to an end. Shall we turn in for the night? Oh, I can go with Luca. Okay, so we have her here. Let's go and see what's up. Okay, we're in a house. What's this? June 24th, 1990. Dad promised to go hiking with me, but he blew me off again because of his research. I don't get it. But whatever. Who cares about stupid science anyway? Girls don't need to know about that stuff. What is this thing anyway? Taban said to keep away from it, but it's so dusty. Surely it wouldn't hurt just to tidy up a little. Dear me, my skirt. I'm stuck. I can't pull it out. Oh no, Luca, enter the password. Stop the machine. The password is the name of my one true love. Okay. How do I get there, though? Enter password. L A R a mommy thank goodness luca oh luca july 2nd 1990 that was close 
think I'd better study a little more about machines in case anything like that ever happens. June 24th. Okay. So, we saved Luca's mom. We went back in time and saved Luca's mom. That was always weighing on your mind, was it not, Luca? You are always thinking of others. I have a present for you. It is a piece of amber I created using sap from the trees in this forest. It required 400 years and a great deal of pressurization to make. I hope you will find it useful. Obtain green dream. Robo, you're so sweet. Thank you. Okay. Okay, let's see what that does. Automatically revives KO'd wearer once. Oh, so this is like a one-time bring back. Okay, that's a really good item, actually. Guys, if you enjoyed, make sure to like and comment as a personal channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.